Welcome back. This is the second video on how to create an account on Taobao and Alipay. If you have not watched the previous video on how to create an account on Shopback, click here to watch it right now. Okay, to create an account on Taobao is really simple, but you have to follow me step by step. If at any point you find that I'm going too fast, please pause the video, do it, then come back. Okay? First, go to Taobao.com and make sure that the top left hand corner is a Singapore flag. Then click the tutor button on the top and you'll be brought to the registration page. There's a pop-up that will appear and click the red button. Then click English which is on the right and the page will change to English. Enter your email, slide to verify and input the verification code. Click Submit, check this box and click Next. Key in your phone number and an SMS will be sent to you. At this point, you may want to pause the video to wait for the verification code, after which you can resume. Enter the verification code, then click Confirm. Once you've done that, a confirmation email will be sent to your mailbox. So you need to go and check your email. When you go to your mailbox, you will see an email from Taobao. So click the complete registration button and you'll be brought to this page to set your password. Set a strong password and username and click submit. Okay, so now you have an account with Taobao. But there is one last thing to do, which is to set your address. To do that, go to the top left hand corner at your username and click it. You will see a drop down and click this thing called Zhang Hao Guanli, which means account management. When you go there, you see a lot of options. Go to So Hua Di Zi, which means shipping address. Click it and you will see this. Click Hai Wai Qi Ta, which means other regions, and try to find Singapore in the second drop down box. Then key in your address and your phone number. But from my experience, you don't have to fill in the last one. Check the box and click the red button, meaning save. And there you have it, you have saved your address. Okay, next we will set up your Alipay account. You can set it up now or you can set it up later. To do so, you just need to go to your email and you should already receive an email from Alipay which is in Chinese. So if you want to see it in English, click the translate message button and click the orange button saying immediately log Alipay. Go to Alipay's website and key in the same username and password as your Taobao account because they are created at the same time. Okay, as for the form, for those who cannot read Chinese, the password is six digits. And in this box is about your real name. The next is gender and this box is about your proof of identity. You can do this later but for now you can just put this, scroll down, select your occupation, select your address in which in this case you are from Singapore. So click Hai Wai and key in your address. Then click chatting. That's all. That's all you need to set up an Alipay account. Okay, finally you can start shopping and in the next video, we're going to talk about how to find the things you want on Taobao and how to determine if the seller is reliable. Click here to watch it now. See you in the next video.